Say hi, Miss Dolly. Say hi. This is Dolly. You might remember from when we introduced her to you a few weeks ago. Um, we are still working on our hairdo over here and we need a bath. But I thought it would be fun to show you guys a really fun DIY tutorial today. One of the most requested um, questions I get, or most requested items, is who makes Dolly's collar? Dolly, oh, look. Show them your collar. Who makes Dolly's collar and where can I get it? And actually, I made it. And it's under $4, I think, completely completed. So I thought it'd be fun today to show you from start to finish how to make the same collar for your furry friend. Let's go ahead. Okay, let's get started. So this is what you're gonna need. You're going to need a lighter, pink ribbon, which is, this is 5 8 of an inch. I just got this from Walmart. This is what it looks like. Good ribbon cutting scissors. Definitely want those. A needle and thread. And then of course, a collar. So I got this collar at Walmart. And now we'll go ahead and get started. Just a long piece and you're gonna wanna go ahead and tie this into a nice bow. Okay, now that you have the bow, go ahead and cut off a good amount. So leave those tails pretty long. So all you have to do is decide where you want to place the bow next. So I think I'm just going to place it right in the middle, right here. And then what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to take your thread and tie a knot at the very end. Now that you have a little knot in your thread, go ahead and take the bow. And what we're going to do is we're going to tack down the bow first together and then we're gonna place it on the collar. So decide which side is going to be the front and which side is gonna be the back. I'm gonna go ahead and choose this side as the front and this side as the back. So what I'm gonna do is just make sure that knot is good and sturdy. And I'm actually not going all the way through the front of the bow. I'm making sure this bow does not come undone with all that fun fetch. <laughs> okay, now that your bow is good and sturdy, not coming undone, go ahead and place your bow where you'd like it on the collar. So I'm just gonna go ahead and stick it right here. And now just attach the collar to the bow. So now the bow is attached to the collar. Take your scissors, snip the ends of that. You're almost done. Now you're gonna take the ends of the bow, little tail, and we're gonna snip those as well. Just folding it in half right here. I'm gonna do the same on the other side, just measuring, folding it in half. And this is gross grain ribbon, which I like to use because I think it's the easiest to clean. I just take this once a week when I give her a bath and clean it, which is great. Okay, so now that we have our little bow, I'm actually gonna snip this little side a little bit more so they match. So now that we have our little bow, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take the lighter. Now this is the scary part. <laughs> you do not wanna burn the side edges. So you have to be very, very light. But I don't want these to um, kind of unravel right here. So if you just kind of need to melt them. So take your lighter and just kind of run it through really quickly. It just melts those little edges. Just pat it and make sure, yep, all those little edges are melted. And there you have it. So cute, right? You gonna behave? You gonna show everybody the collar? <laughs> Isn't it cute? Ryan's behind the camera like holding a tree, taunting her. Okay. I know what your true love is. <laughs> 